Welcome back. We are here looking at the US indexes, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Friday, October 23rd, 2020. And we'll be looking at the SP 500, the Dow Jones, and the NASDAQ. If you're interested in supporting this channel, you're welcome to hit the subscriber button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. So, the SP 500 is down 0.13%. That is not a lot. We broke down even further today. We found support at the 50 moving average. But the technical indicators for the SP 500 are not very good at this point. We can see that MACD has crossed the signal line. The RSI is technically flat. The CCI is pointing to lower levels. And so does the stochastic and probably also the Bollinger Band. However, we are finding resistance and support at this area here, 3,423. So this is all about stimulus. It's about basically just um, dragging time out in order to see whether or not there will be a sim stimulus or not. If there's going to be stimulus, then of course we will bounce from here. If there's not, then we'll most likely fall. But I don't expect a complete collapse in this market. There's no reason for that. Um, so in the worst case scenario, we break the 50 moving average, go back towards the 100 moving average, and then bounce from there. Um, this just looks like a market that is waiting to, to for some kind of good news in order to just explode to the upside. That's what this basically looks like. Um, we did not get a double top here. So that argument is out the window. If we went much higher, then we'll probably have a double top, but that is not what we saw. We saw a market that was pure speculation that we would receive stimulus. Now the market is basically in doubt whether or not we're gonna get stimulus. We're dragging towards the 50 moving average. And if we do get stimulus, then we'll bounce straight up to these highs first and probably to the all time highs. If we don't get any stimulus, then of course we will see downside how much i don't expect that significant of move to the downside but it is highly unlikely that we will see any stimulus due to the fact that senate republicans just don't want to pass a bill before the election so a break below the 50 moving average average will open the doors to the 100 moving average which is 3300 a break from up from here will open the doors to 3,551 and then to these highs of 3,591. So, yes, we look at the Dow Jones. Industrial average is here. We need to get rid of these in here. So, nothing's really happening in Dow Jones. We're, we're down 0 0.05. That is technically nothing. We we basically broke down towards the 50 moving average, found the support, and then bounced. So, as a bound, we're just waiting to see what is going to happen with the stimulus bill. Same thing here, additional stimulus. I think this market will act um, more positively than the S&P 500 and the NASDAQ. Um, Probably, I, I do expect that. Uh, so so um, we'll see. But if there's no stimulus, of course, we'll fall maybe towards the 100 moving average of 27,228 and then bounce from there. I don't expect this market to go lower. There's just too much support underneath. If we were to break through that, then we, of course, will see a complete collapse like we saw back in. And I don't, I doubt that it's going to happen. Um, if we get stimulus, then we'll jump at least to these levels at 28,939 and then to these highs of, uh, of, of here. So if we look at the technical indicators, they are all looking quite bearish at this point uh, and um, we will most likely just stick around here, wait for news to arrive. If you look at the NASDAQ, so... I did a video previously about the uh, tech stocks. You can see that most of them are down quite significantly uh, today. Uh, as expected, we basically rallied uh, uh, in this area here from the 50 uh, to, uh, to the top here of 8% for basically pure speculation that there was expectation for a, a big stimulus bill, which didn't come. 
now we're basically in a doubt whether or not it will come and we are basically hitting support again similar to here at the 50 moving average if there's going to be stimulus we'll bounce if not we'll break down maybe towards the 100 moving average in worst case scenario technical indicators for the 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 nasdaq are mixed we are the cci is looking really nice the the macd is crossing the signal line looking bearish same goes the cci same goes for the uh, stochastic and the bollinger band is finding support here around the 50 and the 20 moving average so it is just a matter of waiting to see whether or not there is going to be stimulus or not so uh, hope you find this video helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by hitting the subscribe button down in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. Good luck and thank you very much.